Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. So in this one I've got some gel polishes from Born Pretty to show you. So I'm just going to get them out. So these ones haven't come in boxes this time. They are plastic wrap though so, and I haven't had any leaks so that's good. They aren't part of the HEMA free range. These are just the sort of regular polishes but these are they're called water light cat magnetic gels. And this is a set of six, so I've got all six in the collection. So I will put um, a picture on the screen to show you what they look like on the website. And also, as usual, there will be links to all of the products that I'm showing in this video in my description box. And if you want to get 10% off Born Pretty, you can use my code, which is up here on the screen. And that will also be in the description box. So I'm just going to open these all up because they have got plastic wrapping. Um, so they are numbers one two six so i'll just take these off and then i'll come back okay so all the plastic's been taken off now um and the bone pretty have these um on the bottle so that you can actually see the gel polish inside and um, but because these are magnetic ones they're all going to look the same until we swatch them so we are going to swatch them all let's just have a quick look so this is is it lw01 and it looks like a gold color so let's just get on and swatch them all. I'll put some music on and then we'll come back when I've swatched them all and have a closer look at them all. So Born Pretty have let me know that they've got a super summer sale starting on the 8th of June. So you can still use my link um, in the description box to take you to the website. But then when you get there, if you use the code, whatever code is in that little box that comes up, you will uh, be using that to get, I think it's 30% off the entire website. So yeah, make sure you take advantage of that. Um, obviously, if it's already finished or if it's not started yet, you could use my 10% discount code. But if you want to use the 30, you're going to get quite a lot more off. So I would recommend doing that. Always use a code. Always save money where you can.
Okay, so here they all are together. And as I was swatching them, they do look like almost identical, but when you get them all together, you can see, I'll just hold them a bit closer there. You can see that they are different, slightly different, apart from number six. And that is very different to the others. That's very, very red. Whereas the others are only very slightly colored. So they're mainly sort of silver um, and gold sort of tones. This one's got a bit more of a pink in it. So yeah, they are very, very subtle. So you could wear those on their own or you could wear them over the top of other color polishes and they would look fantastic. So yeah, I really like the look of those. So they are definitely gonna be used by me. I think they're beautiful. I really do like this, this red one. Yeah, it's really mesmerizing when you just keep moving them and watching them. I could just watch them all day, I love them. So obviously I've just brought all the glitter to the surface. I've not done the um, like sort of swoosh with these. I've just kept them like that because that's how I prefer to, to see them and have them swatched. So let me know what you think in the comments. Do you like these polishes? Okay, so I've got the practice hand out now and what I'm going to be doing is using that and these Born Pretty Ice Jellies from the New X Jelly range and these are the HEMA free ones. So I'm using 06 which is the blue one and I'm using that on the pointer finger. And we're putting a full coat of that on and then I'm moving on to the middle finger and I'm using the pink one which is 05 and I'm putting a full coat of that on that nail and then I'm repeating the process so I'm putting the blue on the ring finger and then the pink on the pinky finger. So after they've been cured, I go in again with another coat, but I only take it sort of a third up the nail. And then I just use a brush just to feather it upwards. And then I use a detailer brush to feather it up a little bit more. And so it's created kind of an ombre effect where there's more color on the tip of the nail than there is at the cuticle area. And I wanted to see what this did with the water light gel over the top of it the magnetic gel so i'm using the number two and that's like a silver based one so that's going to go over the top but you can do this with any jelly gels and you can put them over the top of the magnetic gel so you can cure that first you know use your magnet to bring the glitter up to the surface and then do any shape like a swoosh or whatever you want to do and then you can put jelly colors over the top and it will just you know change that color and it does really give a really good effect i love the way it looks but with this one i decided to put the color underneath and then put the magnetic gel over the top So after all the colour is cured, I'm using a base coat just to even out the layers on the on the nails because they were a little bit bumpy because I put more gel polish at the bottom of the nail than I had um, at the cuticle area. So I just wanted to level that out before I started using the magnetic gel because I don't want, um, sometimes if it's too bumpy, you can get lines in your magnetic gel and I didn't want that. So just to make sure that didn't happen, I went over with the base gel. 
And then I go straight in with the water light magnetic gel and this is number two. And I'm just painting that over all of the nails, just um, one coat. I'm leaving it wet and then I'm using the magnet just to bring the glitter all to the surface. And I'm not doing a swoosh pattern or anything like that on these nails. I'm just using the magnet just to bring it all up so that the effect is on the entire nail. And I love the way this looks because when you move the nail around, you get that sort of flashing of the, of the glitter. And I love the way that looks. They've named these really well because they do look, you know, when they're cured and everything, they do look like water is over whatever colour you've used. So when they're all cured, I just need to top coat them. So I'm using the Born Pretty Super Top Coat and I love this top coat. It's really high shine and I don't notice any scratches using it at all. Um, I like using it on my nails a lot because it doesn't dull um, and yeah, it doesn't scratch either. So I'm just putting that on all of the nails and then they're going to get a 60 second cure. And then I'll show you what they look like all finished. So this is what they look like all done. I absolutely love these gels. But I'm pretty, I've got so many different types of magnetic gels, but these ones, I really, really like them. So yeah, they look like metallic water. I love the way they really shine when you move them up and down and side to side. So like I said earlier, don't forget to like and subscribe if you're not already a subscriber. And then hit on the notification bell and YouTube will let you know when I upload a new video. So leave me a comment as well. Let me know what you think of these gels. I'd love to hear what you think and what gels you're using as well. Are you a fan of magnetic gels or not? Because they can be a bit of a faff sometimes, but I really like them. You can do all sorts of fun things with them. So links to everything used in this video will be in the description box as usual. And if you want a 10% discount for Born Pretty, you can use my discount code that's up there on the screen. I will also leave that pinned in the comments and I will leave it in the description box as well, along with uh, the link directly to these gels on the Born Pretty website. So that is it for this one. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.